Hi everyone. Today we've been down at the University of East Anglia because it's election day and we want everyone to vote. And we've been handing out stickers to some young voters and students. And uh, as we were doing so, uh, we came across the Green Party's candidate for the European election in 2009, Rupert Reid. So we asked him a few questions. Yeah. Most of them environmentally sustainable. Mm. What's your personal view as a European I certainly think that uh, the uses of, of hemp in all sorts of contexts, including industrially, um, um, has been uh, grossly um, underdeveloped so far, uh, and that there's a lot of potential for, uh, for, for hemp in various parts of the economy. Um, another question which is very important is the question of the law and the disproportionate application of the law as it is, especially with cannabis. Uh, uh, cannabis is the beating boy of the media, the political parties, and uh, expedient politicians. What do you say to that? I think that um, there, there is, on the one hand, um, some evidence that, uh, that cannabis can do harm. But on the other hand, I think you're right that uh, the question is whether the, um, the way that cannabis is being demonized is proportionate to the harm. And I think you're probably right that it's not. Um, I think that the most crucial thing, um, and this is of course Green Party policy, um, is harm reduction. Uh, and what that essentially means is that we think that uh, cannabis should be uh, decriminalized so that it can be controlled just as substances like um, alcohol uh, and tobacco uh, need to be controlled. Um, uh, any, um, any drug, whether or not uh, um, um, highly addictive, uh, which has uh, um, serious potential effects on the, on the lungs and uh, on the mind, needs to be adequately controlled. Um, it's, it's wrong to um, criminalize people uh, who are using um, this substance. What we ought to be doing instead is having a proper regulatory role um, for, for the state in relation to cannabis. Uh, it, ought to be, uh, it ought to be taxed. Uh, and we ought to have uh, proper uh, government health warnings on, uh, on packets of cannabis, just as you have on cigarette packets. Is it a local and a national and an international? Uh, I think that uh, cannabis and, uh, and uh, drug policy in general is principally a national issue. Obviously, um, more, almost any issue has uh, local and also international dimensions. Um, but what we would like to see and what Green MPs would, among other things, push for if they were elected to Parliament is bringing in a serious uh, regime of, uh, of harm reduction, of decriminalization, uh, and ensuring that, uh, that cannabis users are not demonized and that instead we have a, a sane 21st century attitude towards this substance. Thank you very much. Thank you.